Have you ever wondered if that curve in your penis is normal? Well, I'm Dr. Rena Malik, urologist and pelvic surgeon, and today we're gonna talk about what is considered normal in terms of penile curvature, how many men have it and how many don't. If you're new here, I make educational content about your health every Monday and Friday. So make sure if you like what you see, subscribe and share this channel with your friends. So in 1997, researchers decided we wanna know exactly what is the average curve for a young, healthy man. And they did this by looking at two groups of men. So one group was men who came in to actually have their photo taken when they had an erection. They had the same kind of camera, black and white images, and they were asked to stand in either profile view or angle view. And they also behind them had an angle grid where they could see exactly what the angle of the penis was. The other group of men was from a larger study called the Kinsey Institute for Research in Sex, Gender, and Reproduction. And they collected information about the penis shape, angle, and length through face-to-face -face interviews with men, and these men also kind of described a self-measurement. And this included nearly 1,400 men. And so when they looked at the larger sample of 1,400 men, when they looked down at their penis, they found that 87% of people said they were straight, and the remaining ones said they were curved to the side, much more often to the left than to the right. And these findings were similar in those that got their photos taken. When they looked from a side, about 70% of erections were straight, 25% were curved upwards or U-shaped, with the remaining 5% curved downwards or N-shaped. This was pretty similar to the photo sample. However, there was a larger group of men who had a curved downward in the photo sample, about 15%. So then looking at the exact angle, and the way you wanna think about this, if the penis pointed exactly directly upwards, that was zero degrees. And if it was completely straight, that was 90 degrees. And when looking at the average angle in both of these groups, it was 65.7 degrees and 70. 4.3 degrees. So there you can see it's anywhere between 0 and 30 degrees different from being straight. And so in both groups, about half the erections were between either 30 degrees to 60 degrees or 60 degrees to 90 degrees. So most people who do have a curve will be anywhere between 30 to 60 degrees off normal. And when you looked at people who were between 85 and 90 degrees, which would be considered basically normal, it was a really small number. It was about 24% in the survey sample and about 9% in the photo sample. And you can imagine that people who are describing their penis may more often describe it as normal than those who got actually photos taken. So bottom line to take from this video is that a lot of people have some curvature to their penis and that's not a problem. In fact, as long as you're having normal intercourse and you're having pleasure and your partner's having pleasure, it's not a problem at all. If it is becoming bothersome or you're noticing a distinct change change from previously, you may have something called Peyronie's disease. And you can learn more about that in my last video about Peyronie's disease. As always, I hope you enjoyed this video and always remember to take care of yourself because you're worth it.